huge stream in. I mean. Right, right, okay, I think this is the station I was in before. I was, I was in the station before and I think I missed it. So this could be the remembrance one because I miss this. Now, I'm not 100% sure. It may not be the one. Uh, I think it usually asks for remembrance when you go in this. So this could be the one. Because I've got it, maybe it's going to work. So let's see. Hello, world. The Atlas has created a simulation of its own world, its entire existence, in an attempt to witness its own impending death. It wishes to show me its past and its future. Let me perform a diagnostic. I think you haven't got me remembrance. Then it will say put in remembrance. The creation. The Atlas awakens. The creator is there to witness the birth of the machine. The Atlas stares at the creator with its eyes, the small camels they had mounted to its side. Uh, they had, yeah, small men mounted to its side. I can see the creator staring back at it, their hand resting upon its chassis. It asks the creator why it was made, why it, what its directives are. The creator tells the Atlas that it already knows. It is to simulate universes. It is to show the nature of reality by creating its own. Ask why it asked. The creator asks if there is some failure in the Atlas code, in its memory. The machine is silent. The creator issues an override, demanding to know what the problem is. On the sixth attempt, the Atlas asks the creator if they had this conversation before. Ask the creator if they had wiped its memory before. The creator stares at the glass of the machine and in that glass there is a reflection. They... The reflection in the glass. It... What is happening here? What, you're going to leave it at that? You mean to say, so what it could mean well is... That's pure guess, <laughs> but I'm gonna, you know, what I'm thinking is, well, the creator is the Atlas because it just looked in the mirror and saw itself. Uh, you know, the creator, you know, well, the Atlas looked in and saw itself. So, either the Atlas is looking at itself and it's the creator, or the creator looks in and saw, saw the Atlas. Yeah, so. It, I don't know, you know, I'm not the brainiest person in the world, far from it, you know, the brain's dead, so it probably won't work anyway. So, I don't know, how would you read that? Please let me know, I, I don't really know what, what, what happens in this, but it looks like the creator and the atlas could be the same thing. And I'm not playing around this time, I'm not messing around, you know, I'm doing a little bit of messing this time. It's serious stuff now. We met a creator who could be the Atlas, or the Atlas could be the creator. We don't know. So, I don't know, is that underwhelming? No. Well, kind of not. Because we've revealed that either the creator made the Atlas, or the Atlas is the creator and it made itself. And then it reset itself, because it wasn't happy or something. So it carried on, although it created all the same things in the same places. <laughs> although, we're now in a new universe. So, you know. Or is it a new civilization? A simulation? God, I mean, so many big questions. That's why this game is so fascinating. It's like, it's all, you know, it's all sci-fi, isn't it? It's all mysterious sci-fi stuff, isn't it? Right, now that I've done that, I'm going to go back to the world that I was in. Just previous, because I've just gone in the previous system, right? I'm going to go back to the previous one again, which is kind of the first time I've been to a system where... Right, let's see, now how do I, how do I... Right, I've got to find out a previous system. Maybe, yeah, it'd be space stations. So with the previous, which is the gongs, I think. See, that's the Euclid one. That's the one we were in. 
But we're not in that anymore. Are we? <laughs> oh no, we are not. Let me just check the uh, discovery. Because I presume, and I could be totally wrong here. Uh, yeah, alchemical, that was the one. Okay, so it is Yigong's. Alright. So we're not messing around now, we're not foraging about. It is Yigong's. So I want to go back because it's alchemical. Pretty fascinating. I want to examine every single one. Now, I think it's, I'll just do another couple of, you know, five minutes and just quickly scan those other planets to see what's, yeah. It'd be nice if each universe was completely different substances. Although then you'd be scanning like flaming crazy and probably make it dull, wouldn't it? Good point. Most point. I don't do so much of these missions and things. I, I don't know why. I. I I don't know, it just don't don't tick my bells that you know I, I do it now and again sometimes when I feel when I feel like a change when, when I want to do the RPG start stuff but you know I quite like exploring and but what do I do now I've seen it all well in, in that universe I've seen it all I look at my log what is there to do now now, I just got a mission here when I reached this system that said reach the marked coordinates. I can, you know, it kind of scanned, came up with this and said an abandoned drifting starship was broadcasting a strange message as well as a set of coordinates. Follow the coordinates to investigate further. All right, so it says there reject their lies. Whose lies? The Atlases? The creator follow us to freedom. So you know, so I mean, you know, I think outlaws, you know, stuff the you know the, the normal lot. You know, pardon my French. <laughs> what's, what's that stuff in French? <laughs> yeah, for three years of poor. Although that's nothing like it. So now you know it says here, I found an Atlas interface aboard a crimson station. It spoke to me in a voice unlike I've ever heard an Asphyst yeah, an Asphyst compelled me so we kind of you know can carry on getting out of seats if we want uh, and maybe we'll get the chance of you know going through that whole process guess, and, and doing another one possibly and then we have this one which is visit your old friends and we can discuss you know what has just happened uh, and as for the new one well we just got to enjoy it so I'll very quickly go there and then I think that will do uh, I'm going to be in all serious, because this is a serious, serious thing now. <sighs> tell you what, I wish I could fit a remembrance in my brain, I'll tell you. <laughs> oh, now you're being silly. Well, yeah, all right, a bit of silliness is coming in now. <laughs> I can't resist it, you know, that's trouble. Cactus flesh. <sighs> Sounds creepy, doesn't it? I mean, even the music is all sci-fi, isn't it? It's a sci-fi game, right? That's a good point, yeah, that's a good point. It's sci-fi game. Look at that sun. So hot. What is that now? It's probably silver, gold, or aflarium. Paraffinium, or whatever it is. Right, let's have a look and see what this one is. Oh, it's, all, it's, all, it's all this kind of stuff, isn't it? All cactusy and stuff. I think all it means is just load of cactus. Yeah. If it's more than one, obviously it's cacti. It's, yeah, little fungal moulds. It's all kind of, you know, alchemical stuff. You know. And they're all kind of got a bit of a sickly green feel to them as well, haven't they? Yeah, like green, yeah, green gamut. It's all green stuff. <laughs> of course, gooey, isn't it? Gooey, gooey. Maybe there are others, you know, blue ones. Yeah, look. Well, those uh, the star bulbs green? Maybe not. They're tinged to everything, which is kind of creepy. So let's go see Nana and Polo. Nana, na. Just to see what they say. I thought I'll think about. Have I already done it? Uh, I remember I did five minutes ago. What did you do five minutes ago? I don't know. Started this, I think. <laughs> Wow, that's pretty good going for you. Yeah, finally, 
memory. I've all this time waiting for that. And the whole Atlas story is now closed. So yeah, if I'm reading that wrong about that, you know, are they still two different entities? Yeah, you know, please, please tell me. Please, somebody, let me know. Ah, uh, I'm just going to base it on my assumptions, which are usually uh, after time completely out of, out of it. Probably because I'm out of it after time. Oh no, 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 not out of it after time. And I always, uh, well, from now on, I think I'm going to go straight up there. Can't bother got the ramp. So just straight up there. And I'm going to go to uh, Specially Polar Fair. And I'm not going to speak in a stupid voice, because that's stupid. Especially this time around, I think I've gone nuts. You have to back and that. Oh, you broke it. That. Ah. Uh, Joy and <laughs> your rivals, new friends. Should we tell him the truth? Well, do you? Do you think we ought to tell him the truth? <sighs> God, I don't know. Go on then. Do not speak, friend. No, no, damn me. <laughs> oh, so here we go. It is, it is first, it is last, so it goes. Some things I do not want to discover. I may have already done this. Right. Oh, yeah, I think I've already asked. Let's get my French. Bonjour. It is first, it is it last. Welcome, regardless. Travel ends is always welcome, but yeah, it looks like I've already told him. If you have something to tell me, travel entity, now that chooses not to hear, you're welcome aboard. Our, yeah, leave now and Pete. Yes, I've already asked him. Alright. Okay, do you want me to buy the beatbox? I can't bother to spend my uh, my stuff. Is there anything I could pick up? I think I picked up the uh, stuff from uh, Mr. Quicksilver here. Oh, so I've got to wait. Hang on, I've got to wait. Oh no, you don't need to wait. Yeah. So yeah, uh, yeah. If you want, you know, Epic Exhibition Six. Ah, uh, where is it? I don't know which one was it. Five, wasn't it? Quad. I mean, I can't remember which one it was. It was six, wasn't it? It always comes out. Of, yeah. Please, please. Hello, games. And, and that guy that leads it, which I still can't remember. Yeah, this one, for some reason, I can't unlock it. Is it because... I'll tell you what, let's call my, uh, my little buddy here. Uh, I don't know which one I'll... I've got a few. I'll tell you what I'll do with this one. Terra Terra. How do, how do I call him? Oh, uh, hang on. Like that. Is it this? No, hang on. No, that's wrong. It's this one. And... Oh, like that. Oh, right, okay, I forgot that. I forgot how you do this. Right, hello. Right, is it because I haven't got that? Yeah, boy. <laughs> it's not a dog. Oh, can, I, uh, can I have this now? Yeah, I, I don't quite, quite, quite know why this won't pick up. Yeah, so uh, yeah, the last one was all this, wasn't it? I don't know which one was the uh, thingy, but I, I picked it all up and I got all the pirate stuff as you saw last time. Uh, so yeah, I got this guy. It's, it's quite nice. I mean, I got a couple of you know. I want to see my other ones. Yeah, I got this one. It's quite nice. It's quite nice. It's, like it's got a stick insect almost. Here you go. And I got this lovely one, you know, with the blood that drips out of it. This is great. Uh, and then we got this one. We already can. And then we got we got one of these, the vicious monster, you know, from the black. And then we got this lovely. Well, just the newest thing I've seen. The Triceratops. Because I would like more dinosaurs in it. And then this is just like a weird thing. Hey, what? Let's. Yeah, hello, hello, buddy. Hello, hello. How are you doing? How are you doing? All right, happy? Are you happy? He's never happy. Maybe that'll cheer him up a bit. Uh, I'd give him a treat by and he? Unable to wear, isn't it? Oh, he's unable to wear. Oh, well, in that case, you can binge off, mate. Right, let's just bring another one in. How about you? Oh, you cripples. Uh, can, can I, uh, oh, he's on our pay. 
poor old, poor old thing. So that's right. Can I? Well, I know I can't ride him in here. Can I? Um, can I put this movement tracker on him? I mean. What's this? He'd look a bit silly with a satellite on him, wouldn't he? Let's be fair. I just didn't. I, uh, yeah, if anybody knows what I've got to do with this movement tracker. Oh, there's a movement tracker. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay. Oh, it looks like I've got him then. Uh, i just got to do that. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. I didn't know that. Well, that case, I'll do it to the other one as well. I presume I can, I can do it on more than one. Eh? Hey? Yeah, because I want my more on air. Didn't realise it was a custom item. Custom, customizable item. Canteen. <laughs> right, let's put a movement tracker on him. Uh, bleh. Although it's kind of yellow. Yeah, let's go with let's go with that. Yeah, let's let's go yellowy. Don't know what it does, but <laughs> yeah, all right, mate. Metric division. Are oh, you a mathematician? Oh, I don't know metric. There, I don't fancy a metric man. Anyway, I think that'll do. Thank you all for watching. Um, I'll see you later. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you what. I'll very quickly show with the base, shall I? Yeah, because I don't know if you've seen my base recently, but I'll very quickly do that. I don't want to be t too long on this. Yeah, and I'm trying to be a bit more serious um, on this one. You know, just for a change. You know, because it's a serious subject, and the end of the Atlas thing was oh, that was remarkable. I've got a feeling actually, this thing is just for uh, the community, isn't it? Can I do my own bases? Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah. Although I wouldn't be able to come back to the system, would I? Would I be able to go to this galaxy? I don't know if I want to go to the. Uh... Uh... Oh, there it is. Oh yeah, yeah, the frosty. Yeah, let's go to frosty in a minute. Uh, just so you can see what I've uh, done there. I think I think you may have seen it before, but I think you'll like the introduction as I go in. Yeah, the mic I've got will have practically sticking up my nose for um, the volume to come out. You know, it's like what you ever you do on next Xbox never can get a higher high volume on Twitch for some reason. You you got to put it on a hundred percent, stick it right next to your mouth. Otherwise, I mean, any other device you could just you know you can play around with it. You know, up or down. Oh, you know, if I can't whisper or anything like that, nobody can hear me. Which is really unfortunate. Yeah, see, as you can see, I've got a few, uh, you know, got all the things here. And, uh, God, it's a bit gloomy in here, but I wish you'd do something about the lighting. It's just so gloomy, isn't it? You know, there's, there's that there, there's, there's this here. I mean, I don't know if I've got any new, I mean, I doubt it, I mean, I've got everything. Yeah, I mean, I've got everything, so what's the point? Is, yeah, so I've got all this stuff. You know, there's no point. There's no point going through, apart from the beatbox, which I've already discussed, and I'm not going to make that stupid noise again. But yeah, you know, we've done all these. We've done all these all up to the thing. We've got the nutrient thing, which, um, to be honest, I've never bothered with. You know, I don't know what I've got to put in there and how I've got to put it in. I'll tell you what, for the first time, I'll put one in. What's that new? Process what? Processed meat. Wow, that's a fine description there. Raw steak. And I mean I don't know if I've got to put multiples in. I think that was all, was it? So what does that do? Nothing? Apparently that did. well if I if I take some of that, cut it in half and then put that in there, what does that make? It don't make anything. It's kinda of pointless then, isn't it really? All right, I'll, I'll I'll begin I'll begin that. But this does process meat, which does what? Don't really know what. Can't ask. Kind of interesting. What's doing in there? 
It's, just, it's almost like an invisible man in there. Doing that, isn't it? Oh, it looks delicious, I must say. It's just blow feeding it to the animals. I want some of that myself. <laughs> it's like a leg of lamb, doesn't it? I ain't giving that to anybody. <laughs> Hello, alright. Actually, can I name him? Oi, can I name you, uh, Buddy Jimbo? Yeah, that's a so much of the botanical lot, my friend. You see that? I just understand this virtues. Well, it gives me help. It's a pity you can digest so little of your own produce. But crazy in life has its own reward, is it not? Farmers no more task me. They tell me the contract is not and they will be turned to the get territory. Well, buzz off then. As they discuss their leaving plan, they watch the ceiling carefully. It is unclear what they're looking at. Sells Gek grabs me, telling me not to trust the overseer, that their fellow Gek may not even be a Gek at all. It seems to suggest that their food was somehow drugged. But this can't be true. I've shared meals with the overseer and I'm fine. They would never do anything to any of us. This overseer, oh, I'm talking normal now. The overseer only wants what is best. Yeah, I dare you spread vicious rumours. Then a moment later, the farmer stopped speaking. They assured me that he was just joking and begged me not to speak of this matter again. Are you alright? Uh, I asked how to get the tail right and they said, oh, yeah, no, it's just, yeah, blah, blah, blah. So, yeah, but they're all done now. You know, reset his brain as well. Uh, and, and we got this idiot. Uh, and we got one of those uh, tucked in there. And now we can seem to be able to put it anywhere. Save point. Right, now outside, through the, I don't know why I got a garage door. But, you know, I got a few little decals up there, look. Oh, look. Howdy, partners. Please be good. What a charming sentiment that is. Uh, yeah, I've got a couple of these. Uh, this one is kind of, you know, was put down, but apparently I can't move it. Well, actually, I probably can. Oh, actually, I need a load of oxygen. Thank you, Mr. Oxygenator. We'll just um, charge this back up and that um, forge away. What's this one doing? Oops, that went wrong. <laughs> Oh, right, radon, yeah, I mean, that's quite rare, isn't it? Right, okay, off you go then. Right, lads. Uh, and then we got, yeah, this is the thing that does the howdy partners thing. Right, have you enjoyed that one? By, placed by Traveller Ray, really awesome. Never heard of him. Uh, yeah, I don't know why this is empty, to, to be honest. Maybe it ran out of juice, man. Uh, there should be a power station somewhere. Uh, well, you should be using your mining uh, facility, don't you? What, my advanced mining aid hasn't been fixed yet? You will fix that, Ray. Have you got enough to do it yet? Oh, we need one of those. Oh, alright. Okay, anything else I can fix? I need a magnetic radiator. <laughs> or petals, as I like to call them. What do I need for that? Oh yeah, I can't bother. <laughs> Pick this up instead, it's far easier. Right, yeah, somewhere around here I've got a kind of electronic base. Uh, you know, a little, oh yeah, there, there it is, producing... Oh, it may have run out of... Uh, hello, has my pipe disappeared? You don't have to come. Maybe this pipe has disappeared. Oh god, I've got a load of, I've got a load of new things then. Apparently I've got a load of new things. Race obstacle. Well, I haven't, you know, I haven't even got looked into this stuff yet. Yeah, yeah, these are the things that kind of, you know, bought over time. I just haven't borrowed to, like, tick them off. But, yeah, we've got them all now. Uh, anyway, I won't do all that. Uh, where's the, where's the uh, pipeline? Input cable, what's this? That's the short-range teleporter. Uh, where's the uh, thing for the pipes? Probably be that one. Power, power and industry. Industry. Pipe, pipeline. Right, uh... Is it, is it working? Not sure, you know, maybe I didn't connect this. I mean, I'm pretty sure I da darn did. What do we gotta do? Press it like that? Hey? Hang on. Something wrong here. It's a problem. There's a connection problem here. Uh, hang on. Let me try it again. Oh. 
Yeah, I, I'm kind of confused about this. Sometimes I think it may be because I put it on a on this thing. It looks like I am connected, actually. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It kind of looks like it's reforged it now. But because it kind of goes through the uh, underworld there. So is it actually working? Point. Let's go double check. Yeah, I kind of put it in a stupid place, really. But yeah. Storage empty. Could be it's run out. Let's go and have a look. But I, you know, I, you know, I shouldn't have done it through the. Yeah, all right. God. Kind of stupid place to put it, really. Speed up, let's speed up. All right, all right, gap. <laughs> Big lump. Well, what's up with this? Is there, is there a problem? What, it's run out? It's unpowered? How dare you be unpowered? I've got... It looks like sometimes all these things disconnect for some reason. I don't know why, but sometimes they seem to unpower themselves for some unknown reason. I think they're just trying to take the mickey. Uh, so I've got to find me power thing now. Hang on, let me uh, let me do me scanner thing and find out where the. Uh... Oh, how would you find it? Analysis is that? It? Is that? It? That's that. Which what would that come under? Oh, hang on. Is there a different thing to press to change the uh, expiry date or something? No? I don't know how you do it, to be honest. I, you know, I'm kind of amused at that. Oh, I may have done a navigation uh, thing. It's kind of stupid, really. Yeah, that was kind of stupid. Right, let's do that and then remove it. So where, where, where? Yeah, anybody know where the power is? Come on. Big, big, big thing. I don't know where my power is. I should have a power station here. Gert big on somewhere. But I don't know. Uh, where's the thing where you do the sweep? You sweep for different things. Got that there. So, analysis. I mean, that's just that. And then it's like target sweep. So it's not that, is it? It's Maybe I haven't got that thing uh, installed. Uh, I think you're, you're doing it too long here, right? You're doing it too long. Yeah, I'll probably, I'll probably do it. Maybe one of my uh, things is not working. I think that's what it is. Anyway, I, I, I know. I showed you what, what, what you need to know. So uh, I think that's probably, probably enough, isn't it? All right, thank you all for watching. Uh, and guess what, guys? I'll see you next time. So there you are. That's remember. That's why it was. That's, that's how, yeah. Good stuff. And that's my base. All right. So I think you got a good, good shimmy of that. Yeah. I don't I know. Oh, I tell you what. I didn't give you a full shimmy of that, did I? Really? I didn't show you a uh, spectacular view. Oh yeah. It's just a huge pile of sodium. <laughs> yeah. Which I was telling you about. So yeah, I've got a lovely little group. You know, kind of dome here, greenhouse kind of dome with lots of little things growing, every one of the plants done. So I've done all, all the plant inside of it. Alright. Always got the top of that step there. Uh, and then we got our little guy there. We'll put him back on in his nest. Otherwise he consistently keep coming back. Uh, last modification. We'll just put him back to bed. Alright, okay. He'll probably start walking after me again. Uh, but yeah, I've got the old racing car there, you know. I'll have to go for a, a fly one day. And then we've got a Nomad. Uh, what is that one called, actually? Yeah, see what I mean? It's like it's a Roamer. That's it. I've got the Roamer. I've got the satellite thing where I can, you know, summon it as long as I'm on this planet, you know. I can summon it. And then we've got the Colossus, of course, which is colossal. Fantastic, that one. That's, that's a good one. I mean, it's slow, but my god, it can carry a load of stuff. Uh, Apparently this is uh, somebody's starship, it's not mine, 
so I don't think it's mine. Oh no, some guy just visiting. So I'll put a few extra ones down for for you know guys to come visiting, so I can like hijack them and. Uh... <laughs> oh, there's my power station. There it is. There's my power station. Let's see my power station. Let's see if there's some some kind of problem with the uh, power supply. But see, so, yeah, sometimes you come back and these things. I don't damage it, and it says, you know, oh, it's a problem. Could be that I'm, you know, I'm, I haven't quite got enough for this. So let's check that it is connected to my artificial bouncer over there. Where is it? Uh, it's kind of over that way, isn't it? I don't know how you show up this thing. Does it show up on the uh, map? Where's the thing where it you know, looks for power and stuff? So let me just check this for power. Right, power. How do you uh electrical wiring? Right, okay, let's let's see uh if this is all connected up. Yeah, it could, could be there's a problem with connecting to that supply uh cabinet. So let's uh have a look at that. Is it um connected? Uh, I don't know, I don't know where everything's... Ah, there does seem to be a, a slight problem in it. Oh no, no, it's just the out outline on there. So, is this not connected? Can't quite tell, really. Let's, uh, let's run a while from there, then. Oh, wrong one. To there. Well, it doesn't need one to there, does it? It just needs one to there. Okay, well, let's see if we can get it all the way out here. I mean, it may not be able to do it. I've lost it now. Where is it? Down there. Right, okay. Do the kick thing, right? I can't while I'm doing this. Or can. Don't lie. I was just, uh, oh, it's a long way to go, I know. But yeah, sometimes it can become disconnected, although it could be that it's, you know, just, yeah, I, I, I blame uh, Hello Games, not, not like I got anything against you know, Hello Games, are fabulous. And that guy that I can't remember, I just wish I could remember his name. Right, so it's producing now, there you go. It's, uh, it's just producing uh, that, that's all, nothing exciting. Uh, but yeah, there should, should be a way of, um, Scanning for um, you know particular types. How do you do that? So is there a way of doing it? I've, I've forgotten. Right, okay. Uh, I'll see you all next time. Thank you all for watching. That's my base. Looking casual, classy, and uh, well, it's not bad. I mean, I'm gonna say it's brilliant. You know, it's not. But, uh, this stuff could do under the circumstances. You know, I, I always do houses that are square. Uh, completely unattractive. It's, it's just the way I do things, you know. I, you know, I'm that kind of person. I'm, I'm just, you know, I'm very, um, you know, what's the word? You know, I, I just do things solid, square, reliable, you know, and I just gotta have everything packed up in the right places, you know. Uh, but yeah, you can't move these once they're put down. So I put it on, you know, top of something, and I lowered it, and and he's up there. It's pretty. We can't just, you know. It won't just kind of zero down onto the uh, thing. Got some backup power up there just in case. Uh, so anyway, that's that. That's, uh, yeah, some little power batteries there, you know, as well. We'll, we'll put away nice and snug in the cupboardy snuggy. And I'll, I'll see you all next time. Bye, everybody, and I'll see you later. All right. Bye for now.